Looking for ways to enhance your training content? Screen capture is a pretty great option. Hi, I'm Josh from Wondershare Demo Creator, and today I'm going to share with you some insights to use screen capture in your e-learning. If this is your first time here, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss the latest tips and tricks for video creation. We see lots of trainers using screen capture in their e-learning, and we even use it ourselves. It adds engaging images to your courses and is a perfect way to explain topics. Today, we're gonna to cover how to snap great screenshots and video for your e-learning content, and the Wondershare Demo Creator screen capture tool that will help you along the way. If you don't have Wondershare Demo Creator, there's a link in the description below for a free trial. So first, let's talk about why to use screen capture for your e-learning. 1. Explain subjects step by step. If you're walking your audience step by step through a task, then screen capture is ideal. You can show exactly what actions your learners need to take to complete the task. For example, with product or service training, you can show each key action your employee, customer or partner needs to take. They can easily follow along and learn how to effectively use your product. 2. Illustrate subjects quickly. A picture is worth a thousand words. When explaining complex or long-winded topics, it can be challenging to be concise and keep your learners engaged. However, if possible, well-used screen capture can offer instant clarity in a much more compressed way. It cuts down on time spent on training, so you and your learners don't have to struggle through a huge amount of text to get the answer to their question. Number three, increases engagement and information retention. We've made videos before about the benefit of using images and video in your e-learning content. Known to boost engagement and information retention, screen capture is a simple way to add images and videos that do just that. Four, stretch your resources. No design team? Lacking in design skills? Pike deadline? Screen capture is the perfect way to make great e-learning courses with limited resources. As they're quick to make and don't need extraneous design, you can add them to your content very easily. With so many screen capture tools available, free and paid, we've made a list of some of the most popular available. There are tools already on your Mac or PC, but if you want something more robust, we're sure that you'll find one on our list that will work for you. 1. Snagit and Camtasia Get together or download separately. Snagit and Camtasia are two top tools from TechSmith. Snagit is a hassle-free option for capturing your screen and editing your images. Camtasia offers another dimension as it enables you to add animations, audio, music, captions and more to your screen recordings, but with a pretty high price. 2. Screenomatic. With lots of features aimed at learning and development, Screenomatic is a top choice for screen capture. There are strong editing functions, easy to use audio options, script tools, and much more. It's also collaborative, so you can get your whole team involved. 3. Tiny Take. Tiny Take is a powerful screen capture and recording tool. Effortless to use, you can add elements and annotations to the images you've captured. It offers a great online gallery and simple sharing options, so it's great for keeping track of your files. You can start with the basic plan, which is free, and depending on your needs or usage, they provide a number of different pricing plans. Number four, Wondershare Demo Creator. Wondershare Demo Creator is an easy to use screen recorder and video editor from which you can get powerful features to record screens, audio, webcam, or clip, cut, and add annotations. It's a robust screen recorder and video editor on your Windows and Mac. It greatly helps to record, edit, and share easily. What's more, Demo Creator has a cheap price, which is very affordable. Now, let me show you how to use Demo Creator screen capture tool for your e-learning content. Firstly, launch the Wondershare Demo Creator screen recorder and go to new recording. Then a pop-up window will appear. At this point you can connect your webcam with your PC as well as a microphone. This is often forgotten but it's really helpful to have a pair of headphones with an external mic. These headphones help you to improve the sound quality and ensure that your videos don't contain background noise. After that enable mic recording and webcam recording and please make sure to adjust to a suitable sound volume. And when everything is done Click the webcam preview window and click that red round recording button to start recording. During recording, please keep in mind that this is all about your personality and engagement. Show your face. As noted previously, while you can record anything on your screen or show presentation slides, include your webcam too. Make sure that your students can clearly see your face. Don't record yourself from far away as if they were watching you from the back of a lecture hall. Instead, try a nice shot of you behind a desk or in a more casual setting. After the recording is finished, the screen, face cam and audio can be presented directly in the Demo Creator video editor. 
You can edit it as you like, such as add some stickers, add text, add annotations. Then you can export to share it to your students. It's super easy to use. Ensure your screen captures are the most effective they can be with our helpful tips. Clarity is key. Although it's quick and easy to do, screen capture isn't an excuse to use subpar images in your e-learning content. Your images and video still need to be the best quality possible so that your learners can get the most out of your content. So when using screen capture, don't just screen grab and go. Make it clear, make it visually pleasing, and you'll have a lot more success. Be mindful of your screen. When screen grabbing or filming, it's smart to be conscious of what's happening on screen. Simple things like erratic mouse movements or desktop notifications can be distracting and cause your learner to become confused. Also, beware of oversharing. Make sure to close any private tabs and documents before you start to screen capture and edit out any information that you don't want to be shared. Edit. Many of the screen capture tools that we recommended have top-notch editing features available. Use them. Cut out unnecessary elements that distract your learners and add annotations to make your screen capture as transparent and understandable as possible. You can also record audio and put it over your screen capture video if you want. Relevance is key. Screen capture is an easy option to add media to your courses, but that doesn't mean that you should go wild and use it everywhere. Stick to placing it where it's needed and it is relevant. That way it will have the most positive impact on your learners. So there we go. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure to subscribe and like the video if you learned something from it. Catch you in the next one.